en este ejercicio de escucha en inglés o en este audio para entrenar el oído en inglés, quiero hablar sobre lo que tú haces, lo que yo hago y lo que los demás ven. Lo que los demás ven que hacemos. Quiero hablar de eso. Recuerden muchachos que voy a hablar de, estos, de, de ese tema y estos verbos hang, have, hear y hide. Esos verbos van a aparecer a lo largo de la charla, a lo largo de la conversación que ustedes y yo vamos a tener, que tú y yo vamos a tener, van a aparecer esos verbos. Ah, ¿de dónde sacas esos verbos, Miguel? Bueno, estos verbos fueron los que vimos en los cuatro videos anteriores aquí en el canal. Si tú te los perdiste es porque todavía no estás suscrito o suscrita al canal, así que suscríbete ahora mismo, toca la campanita para que no te pierdas ni uno solo de nuestros videos y por supuesto aprendas mucho más contenido. Y por supuesto para que hagas el curso completo de inglés desde cero, en orden y gratis, desde nuestra aplicación de web inglés en casa Tunja. La puedes descargar en Google Play Store directamente y en el primer comentario de este video te dejo el enlace de descarga. ¿Listo? Pues bien, entonces, ojo, pónganle atención, paren oreja porque estos verbos van a aparecer por ahí metidos. Ahí tienen la lista para los que quieran ver la lista de verbos. Van a aparecer por ahí metiditos en la conversación y vamos a charlar de ese tema. Del tema de lo que tú haces, lo que yo hago... Eh, lo que los demás ven. ¿Listo? Así que, pues bienvenidos y comencemos. Today in the morning, I got up and I did what I usually do every day. It is a habit that I actually have since when I was at school. Uh, I usually have, or I usually carry, as you can see here, I usually carry this little book with me. It is, it is very <laughs> in very bad conditions, but I usually carry this little book. This is the Holy Bible, the small Holy Bible. And when I want to, to receive um, a word to, to make my day better, or when I want to have motivation, I take this book and I read something. And earlier in the morning, I read that when you have faith, that faith must be with yourself in front of God. Basically, I started thinking, okay, what this means is that I have to do what I do, I have to do it well, I have to do the right things, and it must be in front of God. It is not necessary if other people see what I do, it is not necessary to say, hey everybody look at me, look at, at what I am doing. No, it is not necessary. You just take the other's opinions, I'm not saying, or I, I, I don't mean that it is not important, it is actually very, very important to take into account other's opinions, but in this case, or sometimes, it is better to take all those opinions, or all bad opinions, and hang them in a, in a plant in the street, or stick it in the street, or throw it away, just hang it in a place where you are not going to come back. Hang those opinions there and forget them. Hmm? Because basically, the most important opinion is what God thinks about you. And even mm, important, also, it is also important, is that you take into account what you think about yourself. What do, you, what do I mean? I mean that many times we are trying to, to make more than one effort to please others, to please our friends, to please people who are around us, and we neglect ourselves, and we don't pay attention to ourselves. And 
actually it is not good hmm? because we need to be accepted in the society and we start doing things and when we realize that people don't give that value to you we feel bad but what we have to to have is self-confidence what we have to have is belief in ourselves belief in what we do because it is the most important for the reason for the reason in the in the holy bible it said your faith is for yourself in front of god you have to do the right things because you want to feel good you want to give a lot of things to 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 people to others but because you feel good doing that because you feel good giving that and even if nobody tells you hey congratulations congratulations for what you are doing even if nobody tells you that you are going to hear with others actions what they think about you yeah or even better others are going to hear what you are doing it is not necessary for them to say or to shout out loud hey this man is doing this no they are not going to do that actually it isn't necessary but if you do the right things every single person in the world will will hear that and will react to that and you will receive what you deserve hmm? but the most important here is that you feel good the most important here is that you don't hide from yourself you have to continue you have to keep to keep doing your your things to keep doing what you do if it is correct of course trying always to to please god because remember that god is the best hmm? and that way you will you will feel nice you will feel good but please take that into account remember hang others opinion in the street hang it in a place where you're not going to take it to take it back have a lot of self-confidence feel good with yourself keep doing what you do if that if those actions help others or build others hmm? and don't hide from yourself don't hide from yourself just believe in yourself believe in what you do and keep doing And in that way, every single person, everybody, people around you, even people who are not around you, they will hear what you are doing. Yeah? That is, that is exactly what we have to do. Of course, as I told you, we need to, to pay attention to what others say. Yes, we have to take into account good advices. Yes, of course, we have to. But we have to accept that sometimes there are some advices that are, that are not useful. So we need to forget them or we need not to pay attention to them. Yeah? And keep doing. ¿Tú sabes qué significa esto en inglés? Haz clic ahí. Haz clic. Así. Así. No en serio, haga clic, haga clic ahí, aprendas ese verbo, ¿listo? Apréndaselo. Y si no, haga clic aquí y escuche buena musiquita en inglés. Nos vemos en el siguiente video. Bye, bye.